Today, I'm gonna show you how to print multiple colors in Bamboo Studio. Step number one is to open Bamboo Studio, obviously. Step number two is to import your file. I'm gonna be doing a stop sign today, so this should be pretty cool. And then step number three, we need to choose the types of colors that we're gonna be choosing to print on our file. So go on over to the filament section over here on the left. I want the core color of my stop sign to be red. So I'm gonna choose this main filament to be red. And then I also wanna add a new filament by clicking on this plus button, so click there and then choose the type of filament you're going to be printing for this color I'm going to be choosing this as white so click on that and then click OK so now we have fully chosen the different colors we want on our print in bamboo studio next what we want to do here is we want to highlight the print or file itself so left click on the print itself and then what we want to do here next is click on this color painting feature up here in this tab menu right here so after we click that you can see you should you should have your different colors of filaments here that you want to be picking I want to add filament so make sure you click on what color you want to be adding so click on that and then the tool type down here next is the method in which we choose where we want to be putting the colors some of these are pretty in-depth and you can research them in your own time but for the most part we're going to be using this fill feature right here it's right here it's a little paint bucket so click on that and after you click on that you should be able to just hover your mouse over different sections of your print and it should highlight sections and then you can just left click and start changing items that you want to be that color. As you can see here, it's easily just picking up on all these letters and I'm gonna choose those. And then I also wanna do the outside, so we'll just hover on that. And again, if you screw anything up here, don't forget the back button is up here in the left-hand corner, so I can click back a bunch of times and it just undoes what I did. The other tool type that a lot of people use here is the height range tool. And again, this is like the height at which the layers are 3D printed. So click on that if you wanna play with it here. Again, we're going to move the file here so that we can see the different layers a little bit better. So I'm going to put it like that. And again, if we just hover our mouse over the different layers at which it's going to 3D print in, see how that changes here? It's kind of tough to see. Again, if you choose at what layer you want the new color to start and you just left click, there you have it. Sometimes this works better and sometimes it doesn't. So you're just gonna kinda mess around with that. Honestly though, usually this fill section or this fill tool is the best one to be using. There's also another way. So if I click the back button and I get out of this feature completely and I click on the preview tab up over here in the left hand corner. So we've completely sliced this file, right? And if you guys know about this feature over here, what you can do here, this is the layer height tool. We can see it as it does the different layer heights as it. 3d prints it so from the ground up it's going to print it like this and what we can do here is find at what layer height we want to start printing a certain color like right about there is where I would change it to white right all you have to do here is leave the plus there right click and then click on change filament and then choose the color filament you want to do and then now re-click on slice the plate we need to re-slice this up here in the right hand corner and now if we drag the height tool back up here we can see what it's going to look like with multiple colors here in bamboo studio this kind of allows for different heights to be printed in different colors so there's multiple methods on how to print in multiple colors in bamboo studio hit me up in the comments if you guys have any questions and please consider subscribing how to print in multiple colors in bamboo studio see you guys